Miguel Agustin Pro was born on January 13, 1891, to a well-to-do family. His father was an executive with a small mining villa in the Mexican state of Zacatecas. As a young boy, he was distinguished for his great sense of humor. He wrote comics, played the guitar, and was very close to the poor. These qualities would help him during his priestly ministry. He entered the Jesuit novitiate at the age of 20, and during the Mexican Revolution, he was exiled and ordained a priest in Belgium in 1925 at the age of 36. In 1926, he returned to Mexico, knowing that the church was being persecuted and that he would be in great danger, as the government was seeking to abolish Catholicism in the country. Amidst great difficulties, Father Pro exercised his priesthood and wore disguises in order to bring communion to the faithful and avoid the police. He was also known for celebrating Mass at places he had secretly set up. In 1927, he was falsely accused of being involved in an attack on the Mexican dictator and was condemned to death. Before he was shot on November 23, 1927, Father Pro forgave his executioners and died with his arms open shouting, Long live Christ the King. He was beatified by Pope John Paul II in 1988.